Hey guys, this is Surya from Skilling. Uh, here's another video for our career series. Today's question that I wanted to answer was about our postgraduate hybrid electric vehicle design and analysis course. A lot of you had query in regards to what do you get when you enroll in our postgraduate hybrid electric vehicle course and what are the benefits of it. I'll explain five points which will give you reasons to enroll in our postgraduate hybrid electric vehicles course. In your undergrad uh, or in your masters, you might have learned the theory behind say uh, solid mechanics or strength of materials or computational fluid dynamics or multiport dynamics or for example electric components as well but in undergrad or even in your masters you do not have the opportunity to apply those concepts in real world industrial problems using a industry oriented software right so what we do at skilling is basically solve that solution right let's see how we do the first point is our curriculum is industry relevant right so how do we make it industry relevant we work with industry experts understand their requirements in that day-to-day -day, uh, work profile and take that requirements and build a portfolio of courses that you will take in our PGHEV course so there are five modules the electric vehicle module is compulsory right in this module you will also add IC engine module where you understand about the IC engine power trip. So you know about EV powertrain, then the IC engine powertrain that combines the hybrid part of it. Next, you have computational fluid dynamics, finite element analysis. Both of these components are for automotive uh, computational fluid dynamics where you learn about automotive aerodynamics and automotive internal CFD. Right? Same thing with FEA. So you get to know noise and vibration harshness, uh, pre-processing using hypermesh, uh, post-processing using LS Dyna and multiple other industry relevant software. So then you learn automotive design where you learn about automotive uh, plastics, automotive sheet metal, automotive VAW components, lighting and uh, automotive lighting systems and if you are interested you also learn about the fixture design and the injection molding design. Same thing with multi-body dynamics. If you are interested in multi-body dynamics you learn vehicle dynamics and understand suspension kinematics, steering kinematics and so on. All these are, as I said, designed by people from the industry. So it is built up with a lot of projects that you will be working on. So how do you work on uh, projects and how do you work on assignments and what happens when you have doubts, right? So our skill centers, skill center is where you come and learn this course, is basically aided by a lot of support engineers. You will have one-on-one -on -one support when you come to a skill center so whenever you basically have a doubt one of our support engineers comes to your desk and answers your questions right so how how does the space look like so it is an office environment we are recreating office workspace for you so that when you get into an office kind of environment you know how to work so you will have a dedicated desktop and the all the software will be installed in that uh, desktop so all you need to do is take a look at the videos work on the assignments and develop a strong portfolio right you will be working on 25 plus industry oriented projects in these domains which are curated by industry experts in industry relevant software so you build a strong portfolio and this portfolio basically helps you while you go for any recruitment because you stand out from the crowd a lot of you as mechanical engineers might have only worked on two projects in your four years of engineering think about doing 25 projects in eight months time and that's only 25 big projects there are multiple other minor projects that you will be working on as part of this coursework then the important thing right uh, we have a student outcome scheme so our student outcome scheme is dedicated in order to help you with your career goal if you do all the four things that i mentioned above so we will make sure you achieve your career goal right if your career goal is to pursue masters abroad if your career goal is to make sure you get into a full-time job now, or if your career goal is to improve your career right? so we basically help you in all those things so yeah that's it these are the five points why we say uh, our PGHEV course is the course that you need to take in order to improve your career if you have any other questions apart from the PGHEV course feel free to ask it out as well we will make another video for it okay thank you so much for following us stay safe thank you guys